Ndio mfalme wa Israeli. That's why the king of Israel. Alipotukia Mikaya mwana wa Imla. Hated Imla son Mikaya. Hakuwa hakuokoka. He was not saved. Ukisoma uh, when you read Mfalme wa 1 Kings 22 Mfalme wa Israel the king of Israel Ana vita he had the fight Mfalme wa Sham with the king of Syria Na Mfalme wa Sham anamshinda kila siku And the king of Syria used to beat him every time Israel aliyedua kushinda And he was an Israel promised to overcome Maana aenda po vitani Because whenever he goes to Atafuta ushauri kwa mtu wa Mungu He's not seeking counseling from the man of God Ametegemea waganga wake na He depended on his magicians Ndio anaenda wampigie mburuga He goes unto him to prophesy Hallelujah Hallelujah Nitabirieni kama kweli nikienda hiyo vita nitashinda au la When I got to to war whether I'll defeat or not na kukaa katika wale waganga wake wale and in his magician kuna mmoja aliye jamadari ambaye yeye ndiye mwisho who was the end and the na wengine wote hawatabiri paka yeye aanze kwanza all could not prophesy until he prophesied utafanikiwa when he says go you look wale wote hata kama ni mamia ngapi awaruki hilo la the rest in numbers could not wasedekia what the nekaya said mganga mkubwa huyo the senior magician ukasema tafauti sedekia na kufu. Should you say different sedekia will also Kila mmoja akija aenda utafaulu. Everybody when you come you should say go. Kila mmoja utafaulu. Everybody will come say you go. Sedekia ndiye anaanza. Because sedekia spoke first. Aya, siku moja. Okay, moja. one day akawa anataka kwenda Ramothgiliad akapiga vita. He wanted to go and fight. Na ameita rafiki yake Yoshafat. And he called his friend Yoshafat. Amsaidie vita to help him in the war. Ambe rafiki yangu si utanisaidia kama ndio. He told him friend will you help me? me? Yes, I'll help you. Askari wangu ni wako. My soldiers are yours. Jeshi langu ni lako. My army is yours. Barasi wangu ni wako. My horses are yours too. Bas. Fine. Wacha niite waganga wangu. Wa. Let me call my magicians. Ni waulize kama niende au nisiende. Whether I should go or not. Wakaja wote. They came all of them. Jimi aine na kitu. I don't know 400 and plus magicians. Sedekia ndiye mkubwa wa wote. Zedekiah was the master of all these magicians. Hata ana pete huku na huku. In fact, he had, he had all the ranks because of the prophecy. Sedekia jeni ende enda. Sedekia should I go you go you look at come. Na naye because first kamwambia usiende utafaulu. Should you tell him don't go you won't. Yeye atakalo na atabiriwe kushinda kwenda tu. What he wants he wants to be told victory every time. Enda utafaulu. Go you will succeed. Wote all of them. Ni aine wakija enda utafaulu. Jesus when they come you go you beat them. Lakini rafiki yake akamwambia But his friend told Ni kweli hao watabiri wako hao Truly your magicians here Hao manabii wako hao All your prophets here Wamekwambia uende utafaulu Have told you you go you succeed Lakini katika nchi yako hakuna mtu wa Mungu yote In your land don't you have the man of God At least to inquire something from him Akamwambia ni uko mmoja He said there's one Anaitwa Mikaya lakini mimi namtu Call Mikaya but I hate Kila saa nitabiri mazuri Every time he doesn't tell good unto me Nitabiri mazuri He doesn't tell good unto me every time Ni mtu wa Bwana tena kutabiri mazuri One who says again not to prophesy good unto you really Now, if, if you want to prove let me call him here he sent one to go and seek him to come Mikaya afuatwe mtu wa Mungu Mikaya the man of God to be called and whoever went to him he told him father una bi kweli you are prophet anajua Mungu anazungumza na wewe he knows God you talk lakini ujue and but you know wale For these people manabi wote wa mfalume all the prophets of the king have told him to go so ukisema tafauti utafunga when you say differently you will be jailed oh okay ni utabiri kama walivyosema you prophesy like they did prophesy he told whoever was sent whatever the lord will tell me is what i'll do unto him twende let's go akaj Then he came. Joshua was there. The king of Israel. Now tell me Mikaya. He tells his friend you wait and listen, you know. Mikaya akafanya kumjaribu kwa. Mikaya tried him first. Akamwambia aende utafaulu. He told him go and succeed. He said now you see what he has told me very bad issues here. Kamba wote wametabiri hivyo. But all have said this. Mtu uliye na chuki naye one whom you hate atakwambia na kuokoa Even if he tells you something to save you never believe in that. Oh. Right? Hao ganga wote wamekwambia wewe. All the magicians have told you. Na mimi nimekwambia aende utafaulu. Now let tell me let me tell you the truth of the Lord. 
Ile kweli ilikwambie sasa. The truth let me tell you the truth. Usiende maana hutarudi. Don't go because he won't come back. Akasema angalia nitabiri mabaya. Said, now you see he's telling bad mabaya yote. Now all are bad unto him. Nasikia tena Joshua. You hear again Joshua. Rafiki yangu tena. My yangu. friend you hear what Mika is telling me here. Ufungeni ndani. Get him to prison. Chakula cha tabu. Food in problem. Kazi ngumu. Difficult ah. job. Hallelujah. Kuna mafundisho mengi hapo. There are so many teachings in this narrative. Ya wokovu tena. To say wewe ukiwaumu wachukia muhubiri. When you are here hating the preacher. Hata ngwambia la kuokoa utasema. Even if he tells you something to save, you never believe in that. Wewe watu wakupenda. Be people who love. Maonyo ni mafundisho ni warnings, ya teachings, whatever it is. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Huyu ni mtu anataka ile haki yake tu. This a man seeking for his right. Lakini yeye alikuwa mtu wa chuki. But he was one of hated. Akamwambia rafiki yake twende. He told his friend Twende. Now let's go. Lakini Mikaya amewekwa ndani. Mikaya was already in prison. Wako waongofu kama hao. They are such safe members. Anachukia muhubiri maana amemuonya jambo la. They hate a preacher because they've told him something paining somewhere. Hata alikuwa na huduma kwake ataiacha. In fact he was providing maana jana alionya because yesterday the preacher warned na aliongozwa la kumuokoa and he was guiding the one to save him. Ndio maana yake hiyo. That is the meaning behind this. Na utafaulu and will never succeed. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Aya wakaenda vitani. Now they went to the war. Sana yeye ni mjanja wewe mfalme wa Israeli. He was very wise the king of Israel. Wewe utavaa zile nguo za vita wewe. He told him you will have the war attire. Utaenda na nguo za kifalume. You will just go with the kingship attire. Lakini mimi nitavaa zile za vita, si ndio? But I wear the wewe ende na nguo zako tu zile za war attire. You go with the kingship. Yeye wakikuona wajue yule ni yule mfalme. When they see they should know you are king. Hata hakumwambia hivyo kwanza. In fact, they didn't tell him that way. Na mimi nitavaa zile za vita. And I'll have the war attire. Bas wakaenda vitani. Now they went to the war yao. with their hosts. Wa? Okay. Wale washami walipoona ile mwenye nguo za za vita. When they saw one za kiraia za za kifalume. With the kingship civilian clothes. Wakao wanamlenga Yehoshafat They were targeting him. Yehoshafat said, "You don't injure me. Don't injure me." So they looked at him, it's not the one there. See you later. So he's not the see, one. See of Israel. This is not the king of Israel here. Sasa, so yaonekana yule ambaye amejikinga muno yule. The one who was protected Ana himself so much. Ana vazi la kuliko askari wote yaonekana. He has covered yule. himself more than all the soldiers. Hata uso wake hauonekani. Even the face could not be seen. Eh, okay. They targeted him very well. What? Ore, right, okay. Na hiyo nguo ilikuwa ni chuma hivyo imefanya kulaliana. You know it had a number of kama kama ile e, 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 scales za samaki. Like the fish scales in that arrangement. Now the weapon came and hit him. Yehoshafati akapona. Yehoshafati escaped. Maana hakuwa na chuki na because he didn't hate mtu wa Mungu. The man of God. Ijapo ana vazi lile la raia. So he had a civilian clothes. Aliposema jamani mimi hii. When he said no 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 dear. Yule ambaye amefaa kiraia yule. And the other one in civilian. Hata una nguvu zote. However strong you are. Hata unakufanikiwa kote. You have all the prosperity. Hata umebarikiwa kila aina. And blessed all. Lakini urudi uchukie. But you, you go back. Walio kuongoza hata ukafanikiwa. Those who led you na nguvu zako. Together with the prosperity and your money. Mashetani atakulema. The devils will come and hate you. Hallelujah. Ndio naambia hapo kuna mafundisho mengi. I told you there are so many teachings in this narrative. Tayesa kwa wewe ulilengwa kitambo. Maybe you are hit long time ago. Lakini bado uko hai. But you are still alive. Na siko ya kutubu na kuokoa. Chance is there to repent and be saved. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Mwe watu wapenda. Be people who love. 